Right guys, I'm back in the video, so today we have the start of a new series, so pretty much I'm going to be starting a um, draft to glory type thing, so pretty much this is my road to glory, um, I stopped making road to glory videos only because, I don't know, uh, they, they, not that I'm uh, like focusing on views, but the views weren't very great, and I rather, in a way, the titles you get from not having to keep it as a road to glory, so... It is still a road to glory. I don't have the money, nor would I want to put FIFA points on the account um, because it would be obviously a waste of money. Um, yeah, pretty much. I'm going to be obviously spending 15k into drafts each episode, and we're just going to build drafts as and when, like new promos and stuff like that. And um, I'm, I'm basically looking to make profit. So at the end of each episode, we'll op open the packs and then uh, sell the cards. Probably like add up what we try and get back from it, and. Um, I was contemplating going to do this on a uh, different account and then, like start a fr fresh brand new account, 15k on it exactly, and then just spend the FIFA points and try and get uh, work my way up the coins. But I was thinking because um, obviously this is my main account and my only account, I kind of want to if I get a good pack pull, I want it on this account so I can create content uh, with whatever I get. Obviously, I've um, I did a draft in my Road to Glory series, so this account and uh, managed to pack Blanc tradable. Um, baby version and he was 1.1 mil when I sold him so like I don't want that on another account if you know what I mean so um I think it's all right to do it on this account it's still a road to glory and it's going to be only drafts in this series so I can't think of a better name than draft to glory and I know uh, Nepenthes and Bateson do it I don't think uh, either of them copied did you have a, I doubt they've even even thought of it and obviously uh, Nepenthes has draft to glory channel so um yeah Hopefully, if you've if you've got a better name than that, then uh, let me know down in the comments. But if not, that's what we'll go with and just see where we go from there. So, we'll start our very first draft of the series. Hopefully, make our 15k back and hopefully get far. So, we've got a 4 3 3 false 9, 5 2 2 1, 4 3 3, 4 3 2 1, and a 4 1 2 and 2 narrow. Um, 5 of the back could be OP. I don't want the false 9. 4 3 2 1 is alright. 4 3 3, I'm not too fussed on. But then 4 and 2 and 2 narrow is the one I'm looking at. And I think that's what we're going to go with for our first one. Hopefully we can pick some future stars in here. Ooh, we do get a Nedved, which oh, I thought they'd play him. See, if he's a winger like Bale, they play him on the bench, which would have been good. But I think I'll still take Nedved, because if he doesn't start, um, then we can definitely uh, sub him on. He's a good player, 5 star week for, I think. Yeah, 5 star week for 4 star skills, high medium. Uh, De Bruyne has got better cards, so I won't take him. David Silva, Bale and Griezmann probably wouldn't start anyway. So, not a bad captain to take a little icon in there. Can we get a good striker? It's not the best. Dybala's there for the pace, although he, he has got the same pace as Morata, but Dybala's um, better dribbling, just a better card, isn't he? So, I think I'll take Dybala there. Um, hopefully, Ronaldo here to link up, but I don't know. Oh, Kane's good. Ben Yedder's good, but Kane is the one we're going to have to choose there, surely. Or obviously, Mertens links into him, but only a, a uh, orange link. So, we'll take we'll take Harry Kane there. Not a bad pick. Um, oh, there's a few. Oh, my. Ah, well, it's pretty obvious who we've got to choose. I'm so happy with getting a future stars, but if we're going to take Bruno Fernandes there, surely, because Hadji's not bad, I guess. If it, all of them are uh, not bad, apart from Muller. Uh, but Bruno Fernandes has to be taken. I haven't played with him yet. I, I played with Davies. Obviously, I've got Kimmich on my team. Um, and I don't know. What else? What else have I played with? Uh, Ronaldo I had. Team Lee Ronaldo. Apart from that, I haven't used any of the others. So, do we take... Um, probably Barella, isn't it? To link to Dybala. Then we could do that there. So, that's not, not too bad there. Um, hopefully, some more good picks to come. Uh, we get Suchek. I think I'll take him for the for the uh, Prem links. I wish it, that was his 86. I've tried his 86 and he's actually really good. Ooh, Jordi. Ah, ooh, do we go for Jordi Alba because he's the best there? Or Alexandro for the links? I think it's got to be Alexandro for the links. Um, yeah, not a bad not a bad first defender. There's a strong link in Demiral. Uh, he looks okay. Six foot four. Good defending and physical. Goosens uh, is not a bad not a bad shout. He does link into Sandro. But do we want the strong link and then get Buffon or Szczesny in goal? And get everyone on Kem there. Or just get like to Stegen in goal and get him on seven. I think I'd rather Goosens. He looks like a better card. 
We'll do that. We'll do that. Um, it looks like we're going to have a few players off chem. A, um, ooh, I was about to say an icon would be good for the chemistry here. Leaving us with just an Atalanta keeper. But it's a non-rare, I think, the Atalanta keeper. So, we'll obviously take Hiero. Not the quickest, but really good defending physical. And then at right back, a Prem would be good. And Kufal is a nice one. If only it was a 4-3-1-2, we could play... Actually, that does get us more chem, but Nedved starts to lose. Yeah, he loses nines. Hopefully, it won't stay like that. Hopefully, we can uh, maybe pull a pull a prem, prem player there. But we do get full chem on our keeper right now with either Djokovsky or um, Perrin. Do we go for... Perrin's easier to link if we need to change our centre-backs, but I don't think we will. And who's better, actually? Diving, same, positioning... Reflexes or positioning. Who's taller actually? 6'2. Six 6'2. Two. Six two. They're both the same. I think I'll go with Perrin. Don't mind about kicking and then Perrin beats him on reflexes. I think that's more uh, better than positioning. Anyway, hopefully, maybe, um, I don't know, Chesney would have been good. Um, I think I'll take Fabianski only because if we do need to do something with West Ham, because we've got three West Ham players. Um, might be useful. We do get that Demoral anyway. Um, do I need him though? Is there any point in taking him? Only because we could take up Meccano as a good centre back sub. I think that's what I'll do because he's a uh, he's a better sub than uh, any of the other guys. Ooh, we do get a strong link uh, in Mukiele to up Meccano. That could be something we do. We would need a better keeper, but we could go down that route, or we could go for Quadrado at right back but you wouldn't really get the links there unless we had a centimid from Juve, Kimpembe's French I think I don't know do I go for Mukiele? I don't think so is it? I, I, yeah I, I think I could take Cotrado because he can play centimid or right back and our right back isn't good uh, just yet Bamba's nice, Delaney's interesting, not chem wise Bamba's not for chem either but it's a super sub I'll take that. We do need another centre mid, so maybe Delaney would have been good, but um, yeah. We do get some good super subs. I don't think we'll be able to start Lozano, because you'll be off chem, and neither Carrasco, but Carrasco's the best super sub out of them. Who do we get then? Could do with an icon. Ooh, Martinez links in Dybala. Corona could play. Nah, he's not really a right back, is he, anymore? Uh, Mkhitaryan for them Syria, but I think Martinez is a better card. Is he? Actually. Yeah, he probably is, isn't he? So we'll take him. We've got a few picks left. Hopefully we can uh, get some more chem here. Would be good. Okay, Jamie Vardy might just make us go full prem. Almost. Um, we would need another centre mid. I'll take him, because we can't link the pie in anyway. The pie might be better than Vardy, but we can't link him in. If we can get a prem uh, centre mid... That would be brilliant because that means we can push back some players and get them involved. Tro uh, Trossard might be useful. Prem player. We do need that Prem centre mid to come in clutch right now. Ooh, Kulusevski is interesting. If only he's a right mid, I could play him on seven next to Dybala. Uh, no, uh, below Dybala, but we can't. But he's a good super sub. We still don't have that Prem, uh, prem centre mid that we need. Shakiri could... Or Bowen could be a centre mid technically, but we don't want that. Van Arnholt's a better player than both of them. Um, do we get one in the final pick? It's going to be rubbish, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I don't really matter, does it? We'll take this guy's got pace. Um, okay, that's that's interesting because we kind of I've got an idea for something we could do. Do that. Do. Uh, this and we could we could play Quadrado at right back. This is probably what you're all thinking anyway, but this might uh, might might be good for for the old chem. I don't know what we started on actually. I think that does actually go up. Yeah, it does go up plus two, but then that's a whole waste of Nedved. Then is that even worth wasting Nedved for that? Um, oh yeah, I was gonna start try start Vardy. Okay, so that takes us ninety six. We'll do that definitely. And then we could, I guess, just do... No, that doesn't even help. Um, that's minus five. 
I guess that's the best we can do for now. It's not a bad team. It's definitely not a bad team. I'm really interested in this Kulisevsky because I've seen pros use him and he looks insane. I uh, don't know who I'd take off, actually. It's quite a good bench, isn't it? The keeper, obviously, you don't need. So maybe we need another defensive option. We've got um, only up a Meccano. I can't see me serving on Dybala out of the attackers we've got there. So I think I'll put Alexandro just for that defensive option. But do we sacrifice 5 cam to get... Obviously, so check off cam. So would Barella be? Um, actually, would that work? Do that. This might be just the best play I've ever done. You're probably already thinking to do it, but do that. 99 cam, and then um, we can just sub on a centre mid in Alexandro, maybe, or Barella. Who's a better centre mid? Um, medium high. Don't know high medium it's if we want i think we want medium high don't we so we'll sub on barella into center mid for uh for trossard and that'll be a sick team that front three looks deadly and nedved is a center mid with 46 defending might be a bit dodgy but um yeah i'll do custom tactics and well let's get a manager we need either a czech republic or a german manager and that'd be lovely do we get one no we get a prem one so that helps so check uh we'll do that not Soychek. Oh, no. We don't need um, Soychek's chem. Sorry, no. That was a bad choice. I didn't look for Syria. Um, well, I guess Trossard will have it until he gets subbed off. Um, but, yeah, that's the team. Let's get into the first round. Right then. We found the game. He's got a very weird team in terms of chemistry. He's got Giroud at CDM, way off chem. Navas would be on four chem, I think. Something like that. Mendy off chem. Mane off chem. Ben Yedder, Dembele off chem. Um, only like four, four or five was it? Players on full chem, but um, yeah, he's oh, he's gonna make a sub straight away, and so are we. We'll bring on Barella at left centre mid. Oh my god, we're through in, and one now. I literally, I, I wasn't even recording mode. I was just playing FIFA. I forgot about speaking, but um, we went one nil off. Uh, I don't even know if it was my kickoff. I can't. I literally can't remember. I was kind of zoning out, and then I ended up getting through with Vardy. So one 0 in the first round. That's nice. Any foul? Ref? Oh no. I think we're gonna have a problem with defending here. He's uh, yeah. He's one one. I don't know about this defense or the Soychek's eighty four card. Bit dodgy, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll have to outscore him. For a back Vardy's passing there. Bruno into Vardy into Bruno, little little uh, step over, <laughs> Bruno ain't missing that one is he, don't know what that uh, skill was but it worked, back to Keane, back to Bruno, finesse shot, he's not missing them either, is he going to forfeit already, that'd be lovely, yeah he's forfeit, he don't want the smoke from Bruno Fernandez team of the year, right then opponent number two has got Bruno Fernandez, uh, Harry Winks off cam, uh, Oscar off cam, Werner off cam, Varane off Ken, not that Varane even needs, he can play on zero Ken and be an absolute beast. And this is 88 card, so it'd be interesting. He's got Bruno, um, no, uh, Fernandez, no, what's his name? <laughs> Can't speak. What's his, the right back, Semedo, is a Barcelona card, so not quite sure why. Hopefully, he's uh, not too good of a player though, so yeah. Vardy plays Kane in, surely. I'm going to have to sweat that just to, you know, just to guarantee that goal. Bruno Fernandes, 1-0 before before we make our sub. Ax, though, should be able to help us out in these games. we got Quadrado making that run. Hopefully Vardy carries on that run there. Nedved's played him in. Oh, that's a pen there, ref. We'll have that. Bruno Fernandes can step up for this one. I'm going to try to smack this top left. Hopefully we can uh, bag this. It's what I do with Rooney and he scores. Oh, no, that's not too far top left. It worked. It'll do. He probably wouldn't have got to that. But um, Bruno Fernandes, he's insane right now. 2-0. Wants to play Salah in. Ah, he's going to score that, isn't he? Yeah. 2-1. Uh, I knew he was coming. Hierro feels very slow. I can't lie. Like, if he, if he's like one-on-one -on -one for pace, he's going to lose it, unfortunately. But he's a good centre-back in defensive, defensive wise. The mistake for me there. Very bad lunge. He's made it 2-2. Two -two. That's such a poor defender. I'm not liking Hero though. Um, yeah, we're going to have to sort something out there. Maybe. We'll see. 
hopefully outscore them. Right, guys, not much happened in that half. It was pretty much like back and forth, but bad, bad attacking from both teams. Um, I'm going to have to bring on a good attacker here. Carrasco or Bamba, I think. Is it Bamba? It must be Bamba then. For Kane. Oh, no. I'm out of subs. Right, pretty much I need to have Quadrado back on stay back because he is dying right now. So I thought, who have we subbed on? Barella for uh, Kulisevsky. Ah, we used up a Meccano. Right, we got no subs, so we're just going to have to pretty much just hold this one out. Pajardo's dead, isn't he? So we need to be careful. And there he is. Just standing there. Oh, no. He scored. He's going to hold it. No, he's not. And he's got his, he's got his fourth. I, well, that's just because I've chucked everyone up. But... Oh, try hard to try and get that goal. This team, it, it felt amazing in the first game. The passing was like sharp, everything. Turning was good. Then this game has felt awful. Like, the passing, it was like, it was so sluggish. It was like, you'd pass and half an hour later you'd pass. And then um, turning was just like, well, it was like moving a truck. So, Kane's passing was awful. Kulisevsky wasn't even that quick. Bruno couldn't even make two yard passes. It was not. It was not good. Started off all right, and it just got worse and worse. But we'll see if we can make 15k back, and hopefully, uh, be ready for the next next episode. Um, all packs are good. Obviously, future stars are impact, but it's likely we're going to get a 15k pack and a seven and a half, or two two fives and a seven, or one seven one five and a silver pack. So there's chance for good silvers in here. So that's okay. But um, yeah, maybe we'll get the, get the old calculator out. Um, no future star Rainer in there. We do get a Bruno Zadas. I think that's how you say it. Don't know. Um, yeah, got the calculator out just in case we need to... I don't know. Why is it worth adding up the silvers? Oh, a uh, cheeky silver from uh, Man City. Um, well, he's like 3k, so we'll add him to the tally. Or 2, two point... We'll go for 2 point... Or 1.9. 1.9 we'll put on the the old calculator uh, 1.9 plus we'll get ready to add the next one um, This guy's a league SVC uh, Nah, we won't sell him. He might be a bit Thing is I don't want to put like everyone down. Although I could I could sell everyone um, we'll, we'll go for 700 on that guy Um well, well, we'll chuck that in there. See what we can make back. French, uh, we'll go for what? Like, 650. Um, we'll chuck him up. And then, what else? Belgium League might sell. Go for 300 on him. Um, the rest of them. We'll just get sent here, and then this guy is... Oh, he might actually sell, so go for a nice 950 on him. So, from that there, we are on 4.5k from the silvers, so... And that's without selling the other ones, so yeah, that's not bad. Gold pack, can we pack anything good? I very much doubt it, but you never know, do you? No, no, uh, no um, gold rare in that one either, so 4.5 plus whatever we get hopefully some position modifiers man city player is good um he's worth probably get 1.3 or 4 for him we'll go for 1.4 um actually i'll go for 1.3 just so i know you'll sell um add that to the tally then this silver transfer uh, this gold sorry gold and uh, common transferred looks like it might be like 1.1 add that in um, Traore is probably going to be cheap, yeah, about, we'll go 800, now nah, we'll go 700, get him sold, I'd rather get things sold than keep having to relist them and stuff, transfers will quick, uh, uh, sorry, um, contracts will quick sell, left wing back to left back, wait, seriously? Surely not, I really doubt that'll sell, I'm not going to add that because I don't think, are these actually extinct or, I think there's something going wrong with the, the um things right now but we got 
2.0.25k uh, for that as well. So we're sitting on after that those two packs 7.85k. So over halfway, and then the premium gold will hopefully make us some more coins here. Um, is it going to happen though? No walkout, no board, gold rare. So it's going to be like a 1k guarantee. Um, who have we got? Bauman. 1.7, we'll get for him. We'll get 1.8 out of him, actually. 1.8 for him. Um, who have we got here? Malero. We'll get, like, 550 out of him. And then Artega. We'll get probably, like, 500 out of him. Quick sell the contracts. Cam to centre mid is 5k, isn't it? That's definitely 5k. Um, or is that... Yeah, pretty sure that's 5k, so we can add that. I'm adding that. Um, and then that's not going to sell, is it, really? And those two, we get three uh, 0.3k for the quick sell. So after all that sells, we'll sit on 8.5. That can't be right. Um, I might have done something wrong there. I don't know. <laughs> all that adding up, and it doesn't look like it's right, but... Um, it's not a bad. It's not a bad start. It's unlucky that we didn't we didn't go further. But Bruno Fernandez, he was good in the first game, and then, well, he is good. Let's just face it. We get we we sold quite a few already. Five k for that camp sentiment, so it does sell. But um, yeah, we'll make we'll make profit off of that one. Um, it was a good it was a good draft, good fun one to do, and um, hopefully stick around for the next episode. So yeah, if you enjoyed it, please hit thumbs up and subscribe already. Peace.